McTominay in as a DM. Did, did you think that worked yesterday? Not really, no. Mm-hmm. Um, again, I, I'm, he did okay, but in terms of knowing what you, you know, what can be possible in that position, you know, what kind of balls that someone else on that ball would have done. It, they're the ones that get people in and stuff, and you're like, L- Villarreal did it time after time and kept getting in their boys and the wings, but we just were slow to do it because that's not Mac- McTominay's game. Not only that. When he's on his own, he's not the fastest mover, if you get what I mean. He kind of like, he'll when he's next to you, he'll boss you. He'll, he'll take the ball off you for fun. But when he comes in like pressing and you can pass around him, he's gone. He's gone. There's, there's no getting coming back, really. So that's another thing. You know, like people are quick on their feet, like Fred. That's why Fred plays. Yeah, He's quick on his feet. Fred yeah. moves everywhere and breaks everything up. Yeah. That's the only reason why he's in the side, because... He does that very well. He gets across the pitch and he breaks things up. And that's why he plays. But seriously, Van der Beek screaming. It's screaming Van der Beek time. Like, listen, and you know what? I'm going to tell you now. From the options we got, Matic yesterday showed me again, listen, he needs to be playing. So, and like I said, those two together in the middle, it'll mean that we'll just have control of the ball much more often than not. So and you think Bay and and, and Linda, uh, Bailly and Varane mm-hmm. it means you got no problems there, pacey wise. But here's the problem: you play Matic and Maguire, now you got a problem. Yeah, but you're not. He's not dropping Maguire. Like you're not. No, you Maguire's... can't play too slow with players in the pitch because mm-hmm. people like Tielemans who can't run is running outrunning you, and then outrunning the defenders as well, and scoring goals. So you can't have that happening. It's too easy to beat. So you cool. can't have one person without too much legs and then another one in the same defensive areas without too many legs. Like you, you, you just So you so just can't. you you was impressed with Matic when he when he came on yesterday and he, he says he's revived. Yeah. What yeah. what what is he doing in there that's that's that sparked your interest and can he be the answer um as opposed to having a both uh, Fred and McTominay double pivot? Yeah, he can be the answer. Uh, he, he can be the, the short-term answer mm-hmm. if he plays like that. He had energy yesterday. He was yeah. getting around players. He was not being beat by anyone. He not by not being run by anyone. He was running past people. He was getting hold of it, looking around and, and trying to play it quick and then pushing into areas, breaking mm-hmm. through the lines on the ball and then slotting people in. I'm like, yes, Matic, that's what I want to see. That's what we want to see from a defence midfielder who can just go, yeah, you move that, move that, bang, bang, get, give it back, bang. I'll, f- I'll find you through the lines, like where it's tight. That's what he needs to do and needs to do that a lot more. Like I say, he's not getting any younger. We all know that. So he can't play every single week unless maybe Saturday to Saturday, fine, and put Van der Beek in there. Now you've got poppers. You can keep the ball and you're going to not have to worry about defending so much. Like, the amount of times we lose the ball and Pogba, you know, bless him, he's not like a defensive type of player, is he? Like, mm-hmm. he's not going to get about the pitch defending-wise, but he'll get, you know, he'll get about on the ball going forward. And that's the thing. Van der Beek, he's got a bit of both in him. And, and Matic, he's got more defensive side in him. So to have those two in there is great, but then you lose one of the players in attack. And again, it's all about um, the balance over players. Mm-hmm. You can't just put players in and just pick them and go, yep, yeah, great. You can't. You can't just go, Pogba needs to play, but I've got to play Matic and Van Beek, for example. Or I've got to play them, so he needs to play. No. It's, that's the formation. You pick one of the players that fits in that position. 